Check it out. I drop these girls that's crazy. I do it on the daily. They treat me really nicely. They buy me all these ices. Gucci and Gabbana, Fendi and Adana. Here and they be sharing all their money. Got me wearing black. Burba, I ain't asking. Amen. Never last you, Father. Glory be unto you. Honor, blessing, and glorification. Glory be unto you. Seeds, walkers, or personal wheelchairs. Stop by the big customer service desk located in between C53 and C51 so we can get those items tied before the boarding process begins. Again, Kansas City, 14 7. That's good. Oh, you like it? Yeah. I wasn't expecting it to be that good. That's interesting. I feel like it was like, I like sweet food, but like if it's too much, I get tired of it. Yeah, this is like so good because it's savory. Wow, that's good. Thank you. I'm so sorry about that. I really appreciate it. Nothing else for you today. Thanks. Thanks. I'm that person. I get avocado toast. <laughs> and take a picture of it. Period. With a side of bacon. I need some meat. Some protein. This ricotta, I'm about to act up. <laughs> that ricotta <laughs> hotcakes is going to make me act up. <laughs> guys um so it is like four o'clock and after we went to go and get um brunch i came and i slept because i needed to but now we have like opening session at five and so i need to like get up and get ready 
so that's what I'm gonna do. But I just wanted to update, update you guys. That was, that was beautiful. Kansas City is like kind of looks like New York. Downtown Kansas City kind of looks like New York in my opinion. But yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Hey guys, I decided to film this in the bathroom, but this is what my makeup looks like. It's just very casual. Um, I will show you guys my outfit, which is just this with some loafers, very chill. But yeah, everyone's left. I had to run back because I was wearing heels and I was slipping and sliding. So I came back to get my loafers. Um, and so I'm gonna wear that instead. And so I'm gonna catch up with everyone. Um, but yeah. This lighting is so good. It's so good. Anyways, I will, I need to like run and catch up with everyone. So, toodaloo. <laughs> downstairs right now I like a bozo forgot my resumes at home I literally just called my dad and I was like dad do you see a green folder on your um on your um on the table and he was like yeah you refer you forgot your resumes and I was like yeah so I'm going to the business center and I'm going to print out um some resumes because I need to Um, it is currently 8.10 and I am the only one in the apartment right now. Everyone went to the regional meeting. Um, I did not want to go. <laughs> um, or I will go. I'll just probably be like late. I'm a senior so I just feel like I don't have to go to that. But anyways, so I'm just going to do my makeup right now. I'm just going to put little bit of sunscreen on because it has been so gloomy here like it's not even the sun's not even out sorry for the lighting I feel like I should probably do this like in the bathroom but the bathroom is so steamy right now because I just showered and we don't have anything to clean all this thing off so um I believe today is the career fair yeah today's the career fair i am getting my resume printed for me downstairs by the front desk which is so nice and kind of them i think i'm gonna be really light with my makeup today i'm just going to do some powder and i'm gonna put on these false false lashes they are so they look like my real lashes so they're so perfect because I don't want to wear a bust down, <laughs> bust down. I don't want to wear like a crazy like lashes to this professional thing. If you do, nothing wrong with it. It's just not my prerogative. Yeah, you're probably, you probably like can't even tell like 
anything's been cut up because I just want it to look like I have nice skin, even though quite literally I have this, such textured skin. But that's totally fine. Hopefully I can get into the dermatologist soon. I have a doctor's appointment when I get home. It's not like a, I need to see the doctors, but it's just like my physical, my yearly checkup. And so, okay guys, so I moved because the steam has cleared up thankfully. Um, but I don't remember what I was talking about before, but I have these like eyelashes and I think I was about to do my eyebrows. But yeah, today is the courier fair and am I nervous? A little bit. I just really want God to come through for me today. I use that eye, <laughs> I use that, um, uh, what's it called? The eye or edge it's fine i'm sorry if i suck at these talking get ready with me judgment in. obviously i'm not wearing this i'm wearing a white shirt but i don't want to get it dirty i'm doing this very light makeup i think i'll do some mascara on my eyes a little bit just a little just to brighten it up these are the dreams I never knew I had. So right now I'm not really listening to any secular music. So God has blessed me with the kind of music that I would listen to that's not Christian music. But he's blessed me with that genre that slap Christian right in front of it. Which is just so nice because, you know, I don't always want to be crying on the bus listening to my worship music even though when I was listening to one of the like not emotion inducing worship song even though I was listening to a very chill indie song vibe song and I started crying or no it wasn't an indie it was a rap song and I started crying I just think that's so funny but yeah so he's just blessed me with music that he knows I would be listening to if I wasn't doing this fast and I just shout out to all the creators who make content like all the Christian creators that don't feel like they have to change their content to fit the Christian standard like God is in everything God is quite literally in everything we can make content that is not like so christianese that like people like who aren't christian would be like bro what is this but like just sprinkle sprinkle a little bit of jesus in there you know i just love that people do that or they don't feel like they have to change who they are in the sense of creativity to just fit the mold of what christianity or what christian you know art is artism i don't know just you know like just christian content creators and just all the things like people that just are not changing fit a mold i just really appreciate the people like that and hopefully i can be that okay guys so i've put in the lashes on and now i'm going to take my mascara and blend my real lashes into them so that they look I just have really long natural lashes. As you guys get to know me, you will learn that I'm a very natural gal. Yesterday I met this guy who is also my tribe. I'm Nigerian if you don't know. But my tribe is so small. I'm Ishakari, that's my father's tribe, which entails that that is my tribe. And I met an Ishakari, another Ishakari person at this convention i was so shook i was like you're a sugary and he was like oh uh, yes it's like my brother i am a sugary and he was like oh he didn't say oh but he was just like yeah like i'm a sugary and i was like dude that is so cool i'm also a sugary shout out to our people it was just a really cool experience we just see each other oh for those of you that are like where even are you I am at a convention 
Um, it's called National Society for Black Engineers, um, and it's our national convention. Does these look natural to you guys? They look good to me. Yeah. They just look like I have really long lashes. Anyways, so yeah, that's my makeup done. I'm gonna put some, you know, chapstick or whatever and keep it pushing, and I love a dewy finish. I'm just gonna get on my way because I gotta go. Hey guys, so uh, this is how I look. This is how I decided to do my hair today. Just in a pony and like that. Um, here's my fit. I have like a navy blue and white theme, I guess. Um, I have these pearls. I have these earrings. Focus on the earrings. Yeah, I have those earrings. A very light beat. Um, like I said, I really just want it to look like I have really nice skin. <laughs> yeah, so I need to get on my way. And I will talk to you guys later. Hey guys. But tonight is the 2000 themed party as well as there's the Bible study tonight. So I think our, I'm probably going to go to the Bible study first because it's from 9 to 10 and then I'm going to go to the 2000 themed party from it starts at 9 and at 11:59 so I will be able to go and you know enjoy that too so I'll take you guys along with me should be fun I think it will be Diego. Diego, say I still a wiggle. We'll be in rapping Kilo. 